the uh, peacock look at the tail. So this one we're going to be going to be involved with divide the spine. We're going to divide the spine into um, number one we call the lower lumbar twist and the lower thoracic twist and the middle and upper thoracic twist. So we're going to divide into um, a different twist and that's the spine. Okay, that is the spine. Oh, we have this here. So we um, if the way that we do, um, this is the way sometimes people do is you bend the, the, the neck and the upper head down. So the upper part are longer, eventually like giraffe. Okay? The head is longer. But the lower part is more squatch, so no, no beneficial to that. Okay? So um, the right way to do, we divide the spine into the first, the lower lumbar. So the lower lumbar uh, twist first, okay? So low, no, twist, the lower lumbar twist. So this is difficult. A lot of people have problem with that. Okay? So your lower lumbar twist or your neck twist. You see? So we said, okay, looking back at the tail, or the peacock look at the tail. So the neck move. Okay? So your neck twist. So you get the pain in the neck because you move the neck first, you know. So the whole Tao Yin, the whole Tao Yin is the same theory as Tai Chi. But on the floor, it's easier for you. You see? Like the Tai Chi, like if I, if I do Tai Chi, if I do like this, okay? How it look like? There's no Tai Chi, huh? <laughs> okay, we call window chopping. <laughs> so the neck moving, window chopping. <laughs> and there's no Tai Chi, okay? Now, the whole theory is this. The neck don't move, the upper part don't move, move with the lower lumbar and lower thoracic. So it, it happened to be like this. Seeing my lower, my neck don't move, my lower lumbar move, my lower thoracic twist, upper thoracic, shoulder, and the neck turn. You see? Now I come back. Lower lumbar, lower thoracic, upper thoracic, and the neck. See the difference there? And they're exactly the same, but in, two, in doing this one, it's more difficult. You're on the floor, it's easier. You see the point there? Because you have, you have nothing to reference to it. If you, if you move in this way, you go end up with like this. Head and the shoulder move first. See that? Head and shoulder move first, but nothing on the lumbar. And again, why have to move the lumbar first? Because the lumbar in what with the soul and muscle, and the lumbar, and you have to learn how to relax the lumbar and the soul and muscle, so you don't cram your lumbar together. And that is the one that hurting us, and is pinching on the nerve, and give us a very bad emotional. It's just like people constantly have to live with the pain. And we think that this is my life. I have to have this pain with me the rest of my life. Yes. If people don't understand it and don't do anything, yes, they're going to have the pain with the rest of their life. You see the point, eh? So that is why understand why you have to do that is very important. You see the point? And you watch again, you see? Seeing, second tuck, lumbar open. Now, i doing this position. You know what happened? My lumbar really stretch out. You see? I standing like this? No. When I sing my second tuck in and round my lumbar, I pulling my lumbar open. See the point? It's number one. So sing, I open my lumbar. Now, 
upper part don't move. Lumbar, lower thoracic, upper thoracic, and the shoulder and the neck. Now, coming back again the same. Lower lumbar, lower thoracic, upper thoracic, and the back and the neck. See that? So this is the same theory we're going to do. All the sequence is in this. All the sequence. Okay? So again, you see, you move lower lumbar, lower thoracic, middle thoracic, upper thoracic, and cervical. So your back, your, your, your spinal cord actually can be twisted. And this is very important for, for your whole spinal cord. Otherwise, the spinal cord is going to be too weak, no power. So the theory is um, the, the same, the theory that I explained just now, Peacock, look at the tail. So you are you're turning your lower lumbar first, and the lower thoracic, upper and middle. A lot of you cannot move that much, so you don't worry about it. Because the spinal cord is too tight and locked. And in a Taoism said, this is very serious. You have to get it. Okay, you have to get it. Otherwise, we end up with, we have no more moving, movement in that part of the very vital part of the body. That is the lumbar. Okay? So, you put the hand here. When you're down, so let's show you this side. Get the left knee out, and your hand near your, your knee, your hand near your knee, and first thing you go down, down. Now, very important part is, uh, I tell you one simple secret is that you have to twist your hand. Twist your hand, you see, I twist my arm, and I... I make a connection, okay? I make a connection from my arm to the lower lumbar, okay? So it gives me a help, see? So I, I exhale down. Now I twist my, you see, I twist my lumbar, okay? So lumbar, lower thoracic, upper and middle, and finally, the neck and the turn. So I feel, I feel that my lumbar, are, my lumbar are activate. Okay, let's try again. Exhale down. Now, talker, we got talker for is your arm twist. Your arm twist. You see, watch me again. It's very big. Very big difference when you learn how to connecting your arm to the soy muscle and the lower lumbar. It makes a very big difference. Okay? Okay? You see here? I make a little bit exaggerate for you. Now, now my, you see, my arm are twisting and I feel that I, I give me a power to twist my lower lumbar. Twist lower lumbar, lower thoracic, upper, middle, and I turn. Finally, I turn my neck. Finally, I turn my neck. And I look at my tail. Okay? And I come back again. Okay? Have the idea? Yes. No. This way easier. We go from there. Hmm? Yeah, we can bow bow. Yeah, you see here, yeah? you go this, you can okay. You go this, you you, you try it out, and turn it from here. You get more room and more easy to go. You can do both way. Lower lumbar. Lower thoracic. And upper part, and finally your neck turn. Your neck turn. 
Look back at the tail. They are both sides, you know. You do one side here and you blow the other side. That's right. It's a twisting left and right side of the lumbar. So you do, if you do on the um, left side. So um, it's easy for you if, you, um, if you are, your tail is on the... So the, my tail is on the right leg. So I turn right. You can do it easier for you now in a moment. Now if you turn left, you're not going to see your tail. <laughs> Very hard to see your tail. You try it out. Exhale down. Turn to the left. Low, lower lumbar, lower thoracic, upper, and see your tail. And coming back up. And, uh, and you try to turn on the right side. And feel your lumbar open. The, the most important part is your the most important part is your uh, the your arm, the arm twist. Okay? The because the tai chi you do when you do is a lot of connection to the lumbar. It's a lot of connection to the lumbar. Okay? The bow are quite difficult for uh, some people. It's quite difficult because you find a balance. You don't need to touch your knee. All you have to do is do it. Okay, and uh, it's a lot of stretching and a balancing on the body. So from the from the back, the the bow back up, and now we come up to the bow. Okay, so. Again, up, and down. Breathe. Breathe to your lumbar. Breathe to your lumbar. And rest. We're going to go to the monkey rotating the the spine to the leg out. It's the same principle again, but this one is a little bit easier for you. Okay? So uh, you have a uh, talker force, it's more clearer to, for you not to see that you use your hand, pull and push. Okay? So um, we say here. Okay? Uh, okay, here you make it see easier. So I one hand grab here, the leg is in here. Okay, the leg go like this. Okay. Now, so one hand, so your left leg out, your right hand pulling on the knee, and your left hand push. So we say, pull. You see? you see here, I make connection. I make the connection from here to my lumbar, and it make connect. That's all. You get that? Okay. Now, when I pull like this, I lumbar, it's just like 
a chiropractor try to adjust your, your lumbar, your, your spine, adjust it. So from the lumbar, okay? So you see, I pull and I push. Pull, lower lumbar, lower thoracic, upper, and so on, okay? Again, the neck don't move first. A lot of you still move the neck too fast. So remember, I'm going to keep on remind you, don't stick your neck out for trouble. Okay? Don't stick your, own, your neck out first. The next should be the last one. I remember this when I learned Tai Chi in the beginning. My, my master used to have um, a stick and hit on my head, my neck. The neck move first. <laughs> okay, in the, in the future, if you keep on moving, I get a knife and chop your neck out. <laughs> I remember that, the neck. Because when I turn, my neck turns first, you know. Because really, we're so used to that way. You turn, you turn, the neck move first. So in the turning, rotating, the neck move first. Okay? So that's why um, Tai uh, Tao Ying the same. So don't stick your neck out for trouble. Okay? You move too much, you get a neck pain. Okay? So um, pull. Okay? Now, you see, when I have that one hand, when I pull, I pull my lower lumbar. Now, if I use this hand also helping me, I twist my hand like this, and it's helping me. So when I do it like this, pull, okay, pull, and push. Pull, and push. Okay, pull, and pull. Lower lumbar, lower thoracic, and finally, Move your neck, okay? Okay, now chain leg. Now you, you eventually you go lower, you see? You go, you move from the knee to your below the knee, and you move a little bit. Now, down and lower lumbar, lower thoracic, upper, and finally the neck. Okay. Now, lower. So, lumbar, pull, and push. And finally, okay. So you move your whole lumbar to your leg. It's a very good Practice, I tell you, very good. You don't have to learn them all. You don't have to do them all also. Okay? But you can, um, if you have the books and you follow the books, it's very easy for you to do it. Okay? So that chain leg. So, you see, you pull, and the other hand, Pull. So you see, one hand pull, pull, you see, with that one hand pull, I already have a, I can feel when I pull, I think, when I pull, I think the pull connecting to the lumbar. You see? So if I use this hand like this, I pull, I, I feel that I isolate the command of my mind, of my brain connection to my arm and the lumbar. So, when I pull, the lumbar, I pull my hand, you see? I pull my hand, the lumbar moves. Now, if I, if I add up this push, pull and push, you see that? You get more power. Okay? So, pull, push lower lumbar, lower thoracic, upper thoracic, and up. And, uh, and now that go down lower. Rock your lumbar. Now pull. You see, very important. You must understand the pull and push. Okay? Pull 
and push lower lumbar, lower thoracic, upper and up. And coming back up again. Smile and rock your spine. Smile and rock your spine. Smile and rock your spine. Okay? Smile and rock your spine. 